Hello, I've got something for you to put on. <laughs> oh no. What's happening, free game? We are coming to you live, but I'm not, not live. live. You're I doing say it, it, are you? No, say Jojo, it. you've taken it. We're at home, we're in London, and today is a very, very special day. It's a special surprise day for Katie because you had your birthday the other day, didn't you? Yes, I did. Katie was 79. Comment below what you think her age is. That's not a rude thing to ask, right? I mean, I'm not, I don't care. Yeah. But some people ask, don't go around asking other people what their age is. How old are you? <laughs> some people do get offended, but no, I don't. I'm happy. My life gets better the older I get. Hmm, interesting. By the time you're 100, you'll be commander of everything. I don't want to be commander of everything. Well, then you can hand that over to me then. Yes, and thank you for all the lovely birthday messages that you guys gave me on Instagram. Yeah, they were lovely. Really made me, really made my day happy. A lot of love for you, again. Mm. But for Katie's birthday, we went out, we had a nice day and everything, but I had a special surprise lined up for her, which could only happen a few days later, which is today. And so I've got a very special surprise for her, which she has no idea about, and I'm telling you what, it's been so hard keeping it secret because I don't like keeping secrets in general, but it's going to be so worth it. He's never told me a lie in his life, but only twice when you've surprised me yeah one one time the biggest you had no idea about it until months later when I was uh, decided I wanted to propose to Katie uh, to get married and I chose to go and ask her dad's permission and I had to pretend I was going to work that day while I went down to see her dad for the whole day and spend time with him and then you I came and I came back like she was like, how was work good he video logged the whole thing. I like, know. Every day leading up to you proposing because. Yeah, anytime you... I went out to buy rings or just had thoughts, it was like therapy because I couldn't express my feelings. I couldn't tell anyone. So I just pull out a phone, my phone and go, so um, I'm going to find the ring today and I uh, don't know what to do. And oh, I nearly, I nearly told Katie earlier. Anyway. Thank we... goodness for YouTube. Anyway, we've gone off the subject. So today, Katie, surprised. Have you got any idea what it is? I've got maybe some ideas what it is. She's got this power of reading my mind, I swear. I can, I can read your mind. She actually can. I've had it before, surprises, and then she just looked at me and went, I know what it is. So yeah, she's powerful. I feel like my brain just emits it too much and she just picks up on that. Mm. Anyway, well, even if you do know the surprise, I don't think you can really prepare yourself for what you're getting today. Okay. Comment below, do you have any idea what this could be for a game? I'm yeah. leaving it quite open. There's a lot of things you could guess, but let us know what could you think be it could be. A giant bear. No, we, we're not doing cuddlies anymore. We got rid of Jamie, so we got rid well, of the Well, what cuddlies. about a giant real bear? A real bear? No, we don't keep bears here, Mum. I couldn't bear it. Yes! Dad jokes. No! Bob jokes. So for this surprise to happen, I have to get rid of Katie. So you and Jojo, you're going to go to the cinema, aren't you? Yes, we're going to go see Mary Poppins Returns again. Yeah, that was a great film. We all went to see that a few weeks ago. Oh, it was amazing. He was crying. So much. The whole way through. Yeah, I was just like... So I'm kind of glad that you two are going without me because I don't know if I could take it again. I cried a little bit, like the, the crying moments, but every time I looked at him, he's like, <laughs> you're just sniffing and crying. Once time. the gates were open, that was it. No going back. So yes, you're going to go and do that and then I can get preparations ready for a surprise. But Frigga, you're going to stay with me, so don't worry. You're going to see all this preparation going on uh -oh. and I'm going to be able to pour my soul out to you. Are you going to tell them? I might do. Okay. Depends if they're good. Be good. But before you go there, we're going to get some food on. Mummy has made a very special piece of food. A yeah. Wellington boot. No, <laughs> no, not a Wellington boot. No, it's a mushroom chestnut Wellington. Even though Christmas is gone, all our Christmas decorations. It's all gone! But, it's just a rotating room. Where have you gone? There you are. Yes, but um, yeah, I'm st still in the Christmas food making mode. Which basically means we've got leftovers. <laughs> That's true, that's true, because I had leftover pastry and leftover mushrooms. Show us the Wellington boot, mummy. So there won't be any preparation for this, mummy, because here's one you made earlier. I know, I made this yesterday. We had one yesterday and one today. At the moment, it just looks like a roasting tin with pastry in it. But it won't look like that for much longer, because I'm going to roast it. It's going to look lovely in a minute. It won't be a minute, it'll be a and bit longer than a minute. It'll be a minute for them. Um, and we've got leftover avocado, so we're going to... That's a weird combo. We'll do some roasty, roasty potatoes as well. Could do. We will do. Exactly one minute later. And it was seen that one minute was right on me. Yeah. It's been one whole minute. Look at that. Oh yes. Loaf of pastry. And potatoes, are these done? I would say yes. Gravy, mummy? Oh. Now we're talking. That's going a bit crazy. That's going a bit gravy. 1,000 gravy granules later. How much 
gravy do you think we need? I don't know, one cup wasn't enough. I just asked him to make gravy, guys, and look. I put all the gravy on everyone's plates. You obviously haven't put enough. Drink the rest. No. There's potatoes left. You can have the potatoes later. Yeah. Oh, she makes some Yorkshire's as well. Bob always does this. He has like a midnight snack, which is like more like a full, like full blown dinner. I'm a hungry boy. Anyway, let's go in and watch Prisoner of Azkaban. That's this afternoon's film okay. for about 15 minutes and then you have to leave. This is what we've been doing over Christmas, guys. Instead of sitting at the table, we've been putting a movie on, which we hardly ever do, but we've been getting into a nice habit of doing it. And Jojo's has been sitting at your desk, haven't you? Yeah. Eating Actually, your dinners. Mm. Right, guys, so we've had our food and now those guys have gone. Thank goodness they've gone. Katie and Jojo, they've gone to the cinema. I don't mean that in a bad way. It's just I've just been so nervous to get things underway for this surprise for Katie. What made it worse is that I was started to get the sense that she kind of knew what was going on or something like what's going on because she started like helping me tidy up and everything and seemed very conscious to make things tidy so I've been very very nervous but I'm happy now they're gone so I can get things ready so the surprise what I'm having for Katie is I have paid for her favorite singer to come around and do a private performance for her here in our home and the singer is called Susie Rose someone we uh, found out about earlier in 2018 is a beautiful woman beautiful voice such lovely music and we went to actually see her when she was launching her album in around April May last year and yeah it was so nice to see her live and we've loved her music ever since and Katie had mentioned not that long ago it'd be great to see her one more time or yeah hear her music and yeah you guys should definitely check her out I'll leave links in the description not only for her Facebook page where she posts things but also to our other social media her YouTube and her website as well where you can find out about our music and purchase it as well but yeah really excited to get it ready it's just about getting it ready to make it a performance space and also getting Jamie's old bedroom ready because that's where Susie's going to be staying because she spent the night with us. She's going to spend the whole evening, the morning as well. So it's going to be lovely to have her here. Better get things done then. Right, Free Gang, I've been going at a million miles an hour, I tell you. I've got all of uh, Jamie's old room sorted, so the guest room is ready. Uh, the front room is mostly sorted. I'm just going to get some food on now because Susie's going to eat before she performs. I feel a little bit better now than I was earlier. I think what got me the most is that about four or five years ago, uh, for our first wedding anniversary. I did something similar for Katie. I uh, got us a hotel room and I paid for her then favorite singer to come perform live. And she didn't really have any idea. So the build up to it was like really tense, but really exciting at the same time. Uh, this time, I don't know, it feels a bit different when it's in our own home. There's a lot more prep involved and yeah, she's been able to pick up on it, but I'm really excited for this now. And yeah, Susie should be here in about uh, half an hour, 45 minutes. So I've got to go and pick her up, but I've got to get this dinner on first so she can eat as soon as she gets here. One panicky human later. Right, free gang. <laughs> nearly there, we're nearly at the point now. You can hear that music in the background, that's Susie. I've just gone and picked her up. She's here just having a little warm up, a little practice. It's just beautiful to hear and I'm so glad I did this for Katie now. Katie just called me, they finished at cinema. She's, I just asked her to chill for a bit. Susie's gonna have some food. And Katie's gonna turn up, put a blindfold on her, and Susie's gonna surprise her by beginning a song. <sighs> so guys, say hello to Susie. Hi. This is the lovely Susie Rowe, who's bringing her beautiful music. Hello, lovely people. <laughs> As I said earlier, check in the links in the description to find out all about her music. You can buy her music, you can support her, support her social media. <laughs> Doing amazing stuff and spreading such beautiful music as well. And uh, we've just spoke to Katie and she's, uh, well, she's not both of us. <laughs> she's on her way, so yes, this is the moment that we've all been waiting for. Can't wait, no, so. Yippee! Hello. Hello. Hello, I've got something for you to put on. <laughs> oh no. Jojo has to wear a blindfold. He doesn't have to wear a blindfold, no. Katsum is coming in as well. Come forward. Right, you got my hand? Okay. Where are we going? Just follow. Right, what I'm gonna do, move forward, keep moving forward, is I'm gonna sit you down. If you reach down to the floor, you'll find a cushion to sit on. Okay. <laughs> so get yourself comfy. Okay.
Think of your surprise then, Mummy. Surprise, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> <Not really. laughs> I'm still actually shaking <coughs> from like nerves or excitement or something. Yeah, I'm not nervous yeah. anymore. I got so excited just when you just before you guys were coming in. I was like, oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> What, what do you think, Jojo? Was this good? Yeah, it was sort of a surprise for me. Like, it was like sort of like an excitement shock. <laughs> yeah. Like a happy one. Yeah, because you knew what was going on, didn't you? But you yeah, didn't know what I to didn't, expect. I didn't expect it to be like this. Is this good? Yeah. Do you like how the room's set up? Yeah, yeah it's the candles and crystals. The morning rises through the trees. So how is your evening going so far then, Oh, Mommy? it's amazing. It's lovely. Snacks. Which, especially now we're getting oh. snack-tacular. Yeah, we just had a little break in snacks. Near Susie, she's even singing while going to in and toilet. out of the room into the toilet <laughs> and everything. Yeah, it's been a really lovely night. I feel relieved but happy as well because a lot of energy is put into this. Walk through. <laughs> Beautiful, just singing as she we're walks everywhere. snacks. Snack time. things in a row. Katie's got her onesie on, Joe just got his onesie on, and Susie has Where's got her onesie as well. Where's your onesie mate? The one I got for Christmas turned out to be a bit, little bit too small, so I have to miss out on the onesie party. But the great thing is, is we've got a giraffe playing for Katie's birthday. <laughs> Who else has got you that for your birthday? No one else would ever get that for a birthday. Your mum might, she likes giraffes. So our evening has come to an end. Yeah. You enjoy yourself? Yeah, it was lovely. I've never had to stop myself from crying so much in my life. Why did you stop yourself? Because I didn't want to mess up my makeup. <laughs> <laughs> That's some determination. I just there. didn't want to look a mess for the whole the whole evening. Just like but I, I like I was really I was watching Mary Poppins and really trying not to cry the whole time, and I'm thinking I've come this far. <laughs> I'm not gonna cry now. What was it like when you walked in and saw that Susie was waiting to play? Well, when you heard? 
Oh, it was beautiful. I didn't know whether to take the mask off or not, or just leave it on the whole time. You, you did have it on for a good five seconds. Because I thought you were going to say, take your mask off or something. I just thought when you come off, you might want to hide in there. <laughs> I didn't know who else was here as well, because I thought, is it a whole like, yeah. room full of people? I was thinking that, but I thought it'd be more intimate if it was just us. Yeah. And then it's yours then, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, Susie's lovely. It's yeah. really nice getting to meet her. Oh, Such yeah. a lovely artist. Like check, said, check out her out. Check her music. Subscribe to her channel as well. Let's yeah. get her up to a thousand subscribers. She deserves a million subscribers. Yeah. If you listen to her album, you will hear how much time, effort, and love and skill has gone into creating mm. that album. It's a masterpiece. Like, literally hundreds of musicians have played on the album as mm. well but thank you so much bob thank you for doing that <laughs> you're welcome of that course so was sweet. it good yes i feel relieved that it's i've just been uh when you see the video you'll say that i was i was i was, oh. think i was speed talking out of paranoia and nerves thank you so much you're it's welcome I'm, I'm just glad you liked it so that's it for another video guys but before we finish up we just want to do a shout out for one of you lovely free gang who has requested it and today's shout out goes to lucy elizabeth porter who says i love you guys so much can i have a shout out on one of your videos i'm vegetarian i love all of your content oh. Thank you so much, Lucy. Yes, of Thanks, course, Lucy. you can have a shout out. Thanks for commenting. Thanks for watching. If any of you guys ever want a shout out, I'll leave it in the comments below. We do one every video. And if any of you guys are new to this channel, and you like seeing how Katie makes a determined effort not to cry, then we'd love it if you subscribe to our channel. If you're already subscribed, hit the notification bell so you're kept up to date on when we do upload videos. And we will see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Peace out. Cause this is This is all. This is all. This is all.